Well, as the weather gets colder, you might notice a tire pressure warning in your car lighting up. It's common as winter settles in. So why do our tires go flat in cold weather? Good question. Heather Brown explains the science and how to ensure you have a smooth ride. Excuse me, ma'am. Hey there. Hey, how you doing? Hey, so do you mind if we check the pressure in your tires? Yes, you can. I'm going to be on TV tonight. <laughs> I hope so. I do have a tire gauge if you need a tire gauge, but oh, you're prepared. Okay. <laughs> the driver's getting gas. Look at you, right on the dot. So we're looking for 35 psi at Steve's Auto World in Maple Grove. Okay, yep. Yeah. You're low. Got an extra service today. Oh, yeah. You're right on, right at 35. Just because the light comes on in our car doesn't mean that our tires are leaking air. Nope. Yeah, it just means that they fluctuate. Nate Anderson owns Steve's. Well, they're kind of like a balloon where when it gets colder, it kind of shrivel up in strength. That's because cold air is denser. So for every 10 degree drop in the temperature, tires will lose one to two pounds of pressure. What's the problem with low tire pressure? Um, you get worse fuel economy. Um, it also wears out your tires faster. Mm -hmm. um, you get worse traction on ice. Can you feel a difference in the ride? Yes, I can. It rides rougher. Since 2007, all cars are required to have tire pressure pressure monitoring systems. I don't check it very often because I have a dummy light. But if you have an older car, check every few weeks. Probably use you probably use a little air. Okay. You can find the right pressure on the inside of your driver's side door. Your door is telling us Oh, 33 PSI. Right. Um, what range do you need to be in? Usually your tire light gives you about 5 PSI. And most air pumps have a gauge on them. All right. We're good to go. You thought we just stood around and interviewed people, huh? Yeah. No, I was like, what the heck they're doing right there? Thank you. Yeah. <laughs> Heather Brown. Full service operation here, huh? WCCO 4 News.